I don't remember a tick bite. I, um, I've done a lot of camping here in BC, uh, in central BC. Uh, I, I should have been aware of ticks. I was, I was warned of them in, in, in Germany uh, when I was visiting there when I was 16 years old. Uh, that there are these ticks and, and they can bite you and, and if, you, if you get bitten by a tick you can later on in life develop some brain disease. Uh, just I remember those words being warned to me. I uh, saw mostly ENT, vertigo, kind of uh, inner ear, is a, is a, um, uh, vestibular issues. That's kind of the, the road we went down um, and to rule out MS. In 2006, I, I just got very fluish and then extremely sick to the point of stumbling um, th you know, down the hallway to see the doctor's office, holding on to the wall as I was walking down the hall just to steady myself headaches that were like uh, like an ice pick in my head. Uh, I still get these kinds of headaches even today, but they're not constant like they were then. It was constant headaches, constant migraines. But when I brought up the, if there would be a possibility of Lyme disease, it was immediately dismissed by the neurologist and by the internal medicine specialist. Uh, so that it, it, it is something that I've commonly heard probably twice in my life is we do not know what it is that's bothering you, um, but it is um, certainly not Lyme disease. I joined the family business and, and, and that, was, that was going to be my future. And I, and I started having these, these issues of, of feeling sick, tired, um, uh, having to leave work early, um, uh, having the flu all the time. And my, I think my father, it was a bit of a father-son issue going on there, and and he he was, um, I think, of the belief that his son's lazy, so that that was really difficult um, uh, to 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 deal with. That really did change um, when I was lying, you know, on the sofa bed at my parents' house um, many years ago, extremely sick, and my father standing in the doorway and um, my mother's holding my hand and he did not know how to express uh, you know support he just, I guess he just didn't have the skills to 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 express uh, uh, what he was watching and uh, so he comes in the room and he gives me a little stuffed animal and uh, that was like his way of comforting his son so they believe me.